Hey, what is up everybody? It is AJ here and in today's video, I'm gonna teach you how to use and customize the noise suppression feature in Microsoft Teams. The noise suppression feature is great for when you're on calls and you might have something happening in the background. It could be a dog barking, it could be someone vacuuming, it could be some construction that's happening outside, anything that you don't want coming into your Teams call, some background noise that may cause distractions and disrupt the call. So in today's video, we're gonna learn how to cut that out or at least minimize it using the noise suppression feature in Teams. Of course, if you like this video, let me know by giving a thumbs up if you're on a supercharged way as your computer, hit that subscribe button as well. With that being said, let's jump on the computer and see how easy it is to use noise suppression in Microsoft Teams. So you can see here, I've got a default meeting and I'm on a Mac right now, but this is gonna work whether you're using a PC or a Mac. This makes no difference whatsoever. But we've got a meeting here and we're just simply gonna open it up and we're gonna hit join. I'm just gonna turn my camera on just to make it better for you guys. Hi. And before we join the meeting, we can see here, let me actually get my mouse cursor happening as well. Cool, so it's easy for you guys to follow along with my mouse cursor. Um, you can see before we join the meeting, we have a few options of computer audio, phone audio, room, or don't use audio. What most people are gonna use is the computer audio. So have this one selected, it will be selected by default. But before you hit the join button, simply select on the settings cog just here on the right hand side. We're gonna open this up and it's actually gonna pull us into our device settings. So you can see we have all the different device settings on the right hand side. The second drop down menu from the bottom is actually noise suppression. So it is set on auto by default, but you can also drop this down and change it to high, off or low. And I'm gonna show you what it sounds like when you have it off, when you have it high and when you have it low. So I'm gonna turn it to off for now. And I've got some crinkly chips here next to me and we're just gonna join the call. So I've just started recording the call through Teams, not through OBS, so you get the full experience. I've got my chips here, and I'm just gonna be printing this around, and it's gonna be really hard for you to hear me uh, while I move this thing around, because noise suppression is off. What we're gonna do now, though, is go into our settings. So we can do this either before we jump into the call or during the call. We can select on the more options. We can go down to settings, and then we can get into the device settings. This is the exact same option we had before we jumped into the call. Device settings is gonna open up on the right hand side. Then we can turn, turn that noise suppression to low. And I'm gonna turn it to low, close that so it takes effect. And I'm gonna start talking out while printing the chips at the same time. So you should hear a little less noise coming from the chips and more focus on my voice. And now we're gonna go more, we're gonna crank it up to high. Device settings, go down to noise suppression, turn this on to high. And now this should do the best job of cutting it out to close that off. And now I'm talking, I'm not gonna look at the mic, I'm gonna keep talking while printing the chips. And this should give you the best indication of it focusing on my voice and cutting out this background noise. I'm actually so surprised at how well that works when you go from off to low to high, where, where it's off and low, you can actually hear the chips quite a bit, but when it's on high, it is completely drowned out, but it still focuses really clearly on your voice. I think this is an amazing feature and if you're not using it already on your video calls, you should start using it in Microsoft Teams. I think it's a great way of actually helping you focus on the video calls and not worrying about that background noise behind you or more importantly, not worrying about distracting people on the call. Of course, if you guys like this video, let me know by giving it a thumbs up. If you wanna supercharge the way as your computer, hit that subscribe button as well. 